Hey guys, it's me. Happy Sunday. I'm doing a project today. I'm chalk painting and mirror or chalk painting and sponge painting. Whew, say that three times quick. A mirror. Um, it's a mirror that we had in the foyer that was kind of a brownish gold color. And my sister Elise chalk painted it a cream color. You can see the original color right there. It's cream. And then we went today and picked up some blue, light blue, like a sky blue. It's actually called Soothing Blue. Ah. And also, I use this box in the middle just for the sponge. I get put the sponge inside the paint. You have a bunch of it on it. And then you can use that to kind of dab it. And then it's as simple as just putting it on. I taped off the inside so nothing would get on the glass, although it did, but that's easy enough to just scrape off afterwards with a razor blade. And you just kind of, you know, you want to leave some spots open. You don't want to fill every single gap. This is a finished area. You can see it's kind of cool looking. It's got, it's got, almost got like a marbleized look to it. And the thing that's cool about it is that this is um, like a light sky blue and it's for the beach house which we're trying to make more fun and colorful and the thing that's cool about the color is that it almost looks like you know when the waves crash in and there's the little sea bubbles the sea foam so it's got a kind of speckled blue look to it and it's really cool as easy as pie we got chalk paint from ace rust-oleum chalk paint it's a special mix you have options buy the sponge i like a perforated one like this that has lots of different grooves don't just buy a car washing sponge this is a spe special one that comes out of the ocean and i like the different textures if you want to use different textures so yeah i'm painting it and when i'm done i'll take the paint off and i'll show you the finished product simple product project you can do it in an hour literally and uh transform a kind of an old brown gothic looking mirror to a really cool fun beach one i'll show you the picture soon bye bye now okay here we are with the finished product i'm still going to show it to you when it's standing up against the wall where it's going to go but it really came out cool and if you look closely you know there's lots of voids there the cream kind of comes through a little and i like that because again it kind of shows it almost feels like sea foam when the Waves come crashing in and all the little bubbly blue water and stuff. So it definitely has that beach coastal vibe to it. And I just love it. It really came out good. So once it dries, I'll stand it up and I'll show you what it looks like in the spot where it's going to go. We won't be hanging it yet, but it'll be pretty darn close to the final destination. And for your viewing pleasure... So, it's not in its final position, but here is the finished project. How cool is that, huh? It was going to be a cream mirror, but it really would have, you know, blended into that wall so much you wouldn't even appreciate it. So that light blue now, I think that looks really cool. And again, when you look close at it, you know, it's kind of blotchy. There's some white showing through. There's even a little bit of the old dark brown showing through. But overall, it looks really cool. So there's your chalk paint, sponge painting, Revive a Mirror. Bye-bye now.